You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we are inside the home of the New York Knicks. It is Madison Square Garden, and I think a lot of people remember when Conor McGregor and Eddie Alvarez ushered in this building as far as the UFC is concerned back in 2016. I mean, that place was insane when Conor McGregor became the UFC double champion. From outside of the arena, to build up to the fight, to end the arena when Conor became the king. This was a great moment for the world's greatest experience. Look, the best fights in history have happened here. And on that night, Conor McGregor etched his name in stone. Slips the punch. Beautiful combination there. What a beautiful uppercut. It landed beautifully. Perfect placement on that shot. Oh, big left. That was lightning fast, that right in. Edge of your seat action as expected thus far. What a fight. My goodness, what a fight. And he lands a big left hand there. Huge left hand. Straight right, he misses. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end this far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fist. Oh, right hand. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. Well, the one thing about throwing jabs is that when you throw a jab, you kind of set your, your, your lead leg because you're trying to extend on the jab. If a person has good timing on leg kicks, they will land almost every time. DC kind of just playing with him at this point, right? You think he's got to go in. He's got to keep pressing here. Oh, big left hook there. Lead kick is true there by Volkanovski. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that off. Him. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Absolute freak of a knockout here tonight. That's a three-check knockout, right? Show money, win money, bonus money. Absolutely, J.A. There's nothing more exciting than a knockout in sports. You don't see it anywhere but mixed martial arts. This young man will celebrate this deep into the night as he should. We set it inside the octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 11 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, Elia the Matador. All right, so there he is, came in the champion, and he will exit that way as well. The UFC.